Great! Always do it on my own, so I gotta get through it. And the only thing I know is to love what I'm doing. How's it going everyone? I am the Dungeon Meister and welcome back to the table. And we are back on Eternites again today. And last time we left off, we had just kind of finished the dungeon that we were on and now we are kind of just going through the last couple remaining days. Um, if you'll excuse me, I am recovering from a little bit of a cold so my voice is probably a little bit more nasally and a little bit more congested than usual. Uh, and I, if I go for long periods of time when I talk, uh, I can sometimes just enter a spontaneous coughing fit. So I probably won't be reading the dialogue for this particular video just uh, to try and cut down on how much I'm talking. I probably won't be talking a, a whole lot in general. So just keep that in mind uh, as we get going. But let's go ahead and jump into it. Hey. Baby wipes. <laughs> Hmm. Um, I'm gonna guess baby wipes are probably at a convenience store. Uh. I think I saw these last time, actually. Yeah. <laughs> oh, right away. Thanks. Take off your shirt. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Thanks. Hmm. Okay, I think we'll spend today probably raising one of our stats, probably confidence. Do that by talking to Chani. I cannot do that. Dude, can we just. Well, what can I do? I just want all. I can't. The only thing I can do is karaoke. <laughs> I mean, I guess. Alright, let's start by pushing <clears throat> our shoulders back. I guess it's not karaoke. I guess it's singing practice. Wow! You should try singing at some point. Air in, air out. You got this. Wow, you're doing great. Wow! 
try singing at some point. Air in, air out. You got this. Wow, you're doing great. Wow, you should try singing at some point. Dang, we're killing it air this in, time. Air out. <laughs> you got this. I think that's perfect. I've been doing this for years, and you're already as good as me. Oh, they didn't even give me my last point. <laughs> All right, now we scavenge again because we can't train any stats. All right, what do you want this time? The pirate bear mug. <sighs> the cuddliest <laughs> pirate in the seven seas. Yes. Okay. Yeah, sure. I think this one's in the library. I just don't remember where in the library. Candles. Cactus. <laughs> I sneaked around the city. Ugh, that hurts me. Uh, you're probably still blocked out, I assume. Dude, can we? Oh, and I can. Why can I only train this one stat? Why can I only train expression? Why couldn't I train any of my other stats? Snacks? Yeah. 
What the hell is that? Uh, snacks, probably. <coughs> oh. Easy. Easy win. Easy dubs. Yeah. <sighs> For a prize. <laughs> <laughs> to the main cart at 1 a.m. Yeah, it's 1 a.m. Mario we've just cleared the pathway and I'm ready to go I was actually dreaming that I um, <clears throat> we destroyed the wall <laughs> well Chani let's hope your dream comes true supposed to have a concert today how many inside the wall do you think had a ticket for it yuna huh. there's a barrier around this thing if the wall is protecting it it must be important you're made of oh maybe it'll react to your hand uh, do you have any ideas Try something? What? What did you do? I don't know. Coming down, wall. Yuna, please give it more power. I'm sorry, I don't think we should do this. What? No, keep on trying! You're the only one who can do this! What if... What if we're not supposed to do this? Yuna, could you come to the dining cart? Why did you stop? Your power can penetrate the wall's core. Are you scared? Please, answer me. What if we make things worse? <clears throat> what if we end up hurting more people? 
That would be unfortunate. But then we'd assess and try again. No. I'm done hurting people. Yuna, I'm sorry. But does that mean you're also done helping people? We need to go somewhere. When I saw my power working, all I could think was... How am I going to hurt people this time? I know I can help, but... I just can't... Yes, you can, Yuna. For them. I knew Yuna would help us! One of the millions of replies your message received. That message was a lie! Yes, but the response to it was very real. You just oh. saved the world. Almost makes confirmed? it hurt worse. She really cares about her fans. Some of your fans may have died here. millions out there waiting for you, Yuna. But... Don't you want the world to go back to normal? Your fans need you, Yuna. Okay, Yuna, are you ready? I... I'll try! I have to!
Awakening, a haunting vision that holds me. A sudden rush of energy and all the bright lights that fuel me. I'm waiting for you to get to see the real me now. It's a dream. Just watch how I burn it down. Breaking free. The wall is breaking. Hey, I mean, if it works, it works. You know what I mean? Uh, do you know when you're having a nightmare and then it suddenly turns into a dream? Mm. Good job. <laughs> Sorry, Yuna. I certainly made an impression, didn't I? <sighs> Let's go back to the train. Hey, Yunchi. Yuna? I realize that even though I made mistakes, huge mistakes, that doesn't mean I can just give up. Not when there are people out there, like you, that need It's what gave me the courage, the power, to try again. I wanted to say thank you, Yunji, and promise you something. I promise that I will be there for you, and for all my fans. No matter the cost. Oh, no. Oh, I regret clicking on that. <clears throat> Can't sleep? Did we almost die? I've got the high score. <laughs> what an achievement. And this is just the start of our journey. We'll probably face even greater challenges. But we need to try. Try to save ourselves. Whatever it takes. Damn right, tentacle boy. By the way, thanks. N 
Nothing. Oh, and, uh, about my little ironing incident? Let's keep that between us. Oh, it's lit! It's lit! It's lit. did it! We really did it! We brought a wall down! Yeah! But seriously though, we destroyed a wall! That's amazing! Yeah, I guess it is. No, oh, we need a name! How about... The Legendary Dudes? The Legendary Dudes? Uh, yeah, it's flashy and cool. <laughs> what, you have a better idea? Hmm. The Mellow Booties! Uh huh. Uh, what? It's cute! Cows are cute! I'm not a cow! I'm not a dude. But you could be. And isn't that exciting? <laughs> Hell yeah, Chani. <laughs> what do you think? <clears throat> oh, I get to name my crew. I forgot. Uh... Oh, man. We're just... We're not dudes. We're not cows. But tell you what we are. We're just a bunch of goons. There's... That's better. We're just a bunch of goons. Uh, it does have a ring to it. Yeah, Umbra. We are coming for you. Wait, 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 wait. I found some batteries for my camera. Should we pose? Yes. Well, selfie time. It's a good picture. you find us automated distress signal that I picked up what no way they figured it out a realist train isn't that just a bus <laughs> no it's a realist train and it's amazing too bad it's broken There is nothing you can't fix. Really? As long as you know science. Tweaks here and there, and light. Did Aria leave us any messages? We lost contact with her ever since we destroyed the first wall. A route has been pre programmed into the train's computer. That must be where Aria wanted us to go. Well, then, let's go. Now, I would like to join your team. 
I sense your hesitation. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Sia, a seeker of knowledge, pursuer of truth, and creator of things. Capable of pushing humanity forward even in the face of Armageddon itself. And I have. I know that the walls are made of organic living tissue. Living tissue? Wait, the walls are alive? Yes, those are the sorts of insights I can give you. With the power of science. But more specifically, the power of the machine behind me. Uh... Gang? I mean, she kind of looks like a goon. Don't you want science in your corner? Listen to that speech. It put humanity on the moon. It will save us from the jaws of Armageddon. Welcome to the goons. The party is always more fun with more people. So, I say yes, too. What about you, Yuna? Of course we want science in our corner. It's a yes for me, too. Welcome aboard. He has a transforming arm. Yuna can do soft magic. She's basically a witch. And I am the brains of the group. Um, what did you say about that arm? It's kind of sick. Hmm, you're radiating electrical frequencies. Charging module activated. My machine is reacting to the arm and creating energy. Science! Yeah, science, bitch! Hmm, I wonder. Should we get going? I'll start the train. Good call. Good call. The first wall has fallen to the humans. Send me to deal with them then. Negative. You are needed here to find the totem. What if they break through the second wall? What are we going to do then? We will deal with those variables when they are known. Human weakness is acting on unknown variables. Our song. You can bring him back, right? He is a known variable. What do you need me to do? Find the totem and begin the ritual. So, these cores, when triggered, destroy a wall? Yes, I believe I can assist you with that. We need all of it we can get. So, uh, you know about our powers. Do you have any? Yes, I can cast ice. And it is an apt reminder of how I should be. Cool-headed and rational. Ice powers? Oh, that's so cool! It is so cool. I know, right? Configurations updated. I've reprogrammed my machine to detect cores. You really can do anything with science. Next corner, 
cannot be outside. There won't be any monsters there. Look so spooky. Yes, they certainly have some interesting external characteristics. Hey, somebody should stay back and watch the train. I guess that's me. I guess it is home now, huh? The amount of material these walls can absorb is astounding. This used to be an industrial hub. What can do this and still be a living organism? Behind the pillar. It's safe now. What are you doing here? I got lost running away from some monsters. Do you have any powers? <sighs> Wait. Yuna? The pop star? <laughs> you can destroy walls? Correct. There is a strong energy signature close by. It must be the core. Are you okay, Min? Yeah, I think so. Excellent. Now, when you ran through the wall, did you see a giant beating heart? Giant eyes? <gasps> Maybe even a giant brain? Pog. Poggers. I'm so sorry. Pervert. I didn't mean to do it. But you're still doing it. I can't believe I touched her. I'm so sorry. I'm not a pervert. Yeah, me neither. Get out of 
out of here. Uh, I think my ankle is sprained. Piggyback? Uh, I don't think I'm ready. I know. Just give me a moment. Why does it move like a titan? Like from Attack on Titan? The way its body like squirms and stuff. Don't see me. Thing go away, or do I just have to outrun?
think you're supposed to attempt to outrun it. Part always it just goes on for so long. That was close. It's just the first time I've done this, okay? Thank you. Just when you think it's over, there's another freaking stage. It's like, come on. Just when you think it's over, there's another part. I hope we get out of here soon. It's a good thing they don't chase me through these, like, acid puddles when I'm slow and vulnerable. Man, this, this part is literally just the worst part of the game. That's no combat. It's just sneaking and trying to survive. <laughs> I think I'd die here. Yeah. <laughs> what happens if you die in the... I've never died in the puddle. Oh, you just spontaneously combust. <laughs> are a rare and precious thing these days. It's not. 
I was part of a running team. When the world ended, we became our camp's lifeline. We were scavenging a town close by, and we found a grocery store full of food. Guys, there's a drugstore across the street. I'm going over there. I'll come with you. It'll just take a second. I was so excited. Food and medicine. I should have been more careful. I was in the pharmacy for a minute, maybe two, when the screaming started. By the time I came back, so he was, was, I didn't know what to do. So I hid. I hid while May turned into one of them. That's when Bona saw me. And we just looked at each other. I just wanted her to stay away from me. I wanted to be safe. So I closed my eyes. When I opened them, the monsters and Bona, they were gone. They were my team. And I let them down. I should have done something. Anything. I should have protected them. But I didn't. I closed my eyes. Bona, Sohi, May. The real team died that day. I don't deserve to wear a hat. I should have. I think I feel better now. You can let me down. No, not the Culver's employee. Do I have any like skills I can learn?
never-ending combos. Taking this thing to school. This thing just got played. Holy... Guys! Are you okay? I'm fine. This is where the energy signal originated from. Sorry, it's just... that's amazing. What's going on? The core is being fused into the wall. Fused? Yes, and if it succeeds, the wall's regenerative properties will be boosted. To the point of making it essentially indestructible. How do we stop it? How do we stop the fusion? There is only one way. We destroy them. I'm sorry, them? Yes, according to my device, we have two cores we need to deal with. We have 11 days before they are fully fused into the wall. Let's go destroy them then! Allow me! <laughs> my ego is bruised. Like always, it's up to pop stars like me. To break down walls and bring us all closer together. Oof. It didn't work last time, okay? Well, since the pop star failed to <laughs> break down this wall and bring us all closer together. <laughs> Shut up! Let's all try. I don't think I can do this. Min. What you think doesn't matter. We need to know. Uh, okay. I'll try. Sheesh. <clears throat> Way to go! That was excellent, Min. Let's go back to the train. I'd like to run some tests. Focus, yeah. Focus. Just gonna leave your computer there? Glad you made it back in one piece! Oh, um, hi. I'm Shani. I am the brains of... <clears throat> I'm, I'm the funny sidekick of the group. <laughs> Oof. But enough about me. Who are you? Oh, I'm Min. She can create shields. I bet it won't be able to protect you from my... charm. Yikes. That was a joke. <clears throat> anyway, what uh what happened at the wall? Hey. I just wanted to thank you for the piggyback ride. And apologize for squeezing you so hard. Squeezing your back! Your back! <laughs> Not your... I'm so sorry, I'm a terrible person! You should have just left me down there with the monsters! Where I belong! 
Life's been hard, huh? I didn't do anything. My friends died and I didn't do anything. feel that <laughs> No, I mean you make <clears throat> terrible jokes. You know that? <laughs> I laughed. That's good. Oh man. <laughs> Thank you for saving me. Can I talk to you about something? Coach, it's just you just seem so confident. You weren't scared, you weren't panicky. Could you please teach me how you do that? Uh, sure, thank you. I won't let you down, Coach. What did I just say? Yes. <laughs> rooms are on the train you can use except the car on the other side of this lobby I've claimed it as my temporary research center oh okay I'll use some of the other rooms this is starting to feel like a field trip fight? no I'm okay you wouldn't survive <laughs> yeah hell yeah we need to focus. We have 11 days to find the core and destroy it. I've also discovered that the coordinates Arya left us are to... to the Kafka lab. It's nothing. Let's just get there before the stone is fully awakened. I think this is a pretty good spot to end. We are going a little long here. So we'll wrap up the episode here. Um, we need to go and talk to Sia still, and then the story will continue. But I think we'll leave that for the next episode. So thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, I will see you in the next one. Always do it on my own, so I gotta get through it And the only thing I know is to love what I'm doing Never give up, never slow, till I finally prove it Never listen to the no's, I just wanna keep moving Keep my head up when I act, head up, that's a fact Never looking back, I'ma keep myself on track Keep my head up, staying strong, always moving on Feel I don't belong, tell my thoughts to move along